So we're going to be reviewing like one of my wife's favorite artists. The re- we just did a Selena Gomez song. And now that inspired me. Hey, we never reacted to a, the real Selena, right? Beautiful Selena. The one that was about to cross over in the 90s. The dancer, the singer, English and Spanish. We got her one of her English songs today. Um, her life was cut way too short. She was going to cross over. I was just telling Chris. Um, this one, my wife uh, sang this one on karaoke once. The first time I ever heard the song, I'm like, what the hell is this? Mm. Mo- most of her songs are Spanish, but she started doing some English ones too, like later in her career. Well, not later, but you know, her career was so short. But um, this is an English one. And this one, she's actually doing it live. I don't think I've ever seen this one live, but you get to, Chris, you get to enjoy so actually seeing her um, perform here as well. All right. And Looking forward to it. Let's see it. She's a good looker, too. Here we go. So that's from the 80s. 
Uh, 90s, like early 90s. Early 90s, okay. Yeah, she got murdered in the, like, 94, and I think she started getting popular, like, in 89, 90, 91, 92, 93. She started, like, doing Grammy, like, so she would have made, she was about to, like, cross over, like, fully. She was basically catered to, like, the border kids. Like, actually, she came here to Yuma when my Mm -hmm. wife was junior high. Mm-hmm. And their tickets were free, and her mom wouldn't let her go. She doesn't wow. let her mom forget it to this day. Wow. <laughs> yeah, and then the year next year she died. So that song, that rendition, whatever, it very much reminds me of the eighties music, right? Yeah, you know, like yeah, like uh, I had to look it up while the song was playing. Uh, Sheila E. I don't know if you've ever. Oh heard yeah, of, her. of course, Sheila E. was with Prince. Yeah, very yeah. much reminded me of Sheila E. Yeah, she's probably like inspired by sounds. all those Janet Jacksons, inspired yeah. by all those people. Sheila E. Apollonia. If you watch the movie, Selena, the movie, you'll see like the story and all okay. that. But man, she would have like you just think, all right, she would have been like the first one to cross over like to both Spanish and English. Now they're doing it a lot, but it's sure. just not the same. Mm-hmm. Not the same as the OG, the original um selena so there we go if you guys like more we'll do some she has some good ones in spanish like some cumbia and uh she does some good dancing in those ones too this one she didn't really dance much not a dancing yeah. song yeah it, it was good um i would give it a, for me a seven and a half for me this one's a 10 mainly because it's like the first time i heard selena in english and it was from my wife singing in karaoke i was like what the hell is this yeah and then I look, I'm like, oh, it's Selena, really? She did that? So she has a few. She has another English song, um, Late at Night, When All the World's Sleeping, something like that. And then it was featured in a video game, um, Final Fantasy, I think it was like at the end. So I knew her like back then, but for her English songs. But now I know her for all her Spanish ones. <laughs> all right. They play, you go to any Mexican party, it gets late enough, all the girls dora's age around her age playing this is like their favorite their idol selena gomez huh no not selena gomez selena quintanero i whatever what's her last name guys selena cube something oh yeah selena gomez the new one oh, okay my bad yeah her parents just liked selena a lot so they named her that okay yeah right. uh, fair enough there we go guys let us know what you think should we react to more? Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, share. Put your comments. If Chris likes it, I don't count for Selena. I'm a, a fan already. If Chris likes it, 9 out of 10, you're going to win money. That's so right. Put it down there. Let's see. Yep. Catch you later. Bye-bye. Yep.